Well, what's up guys, it's your boy Damone, and welcome back to another New World video. As you guys can see, we're looking at the market today, and I'm going to talk about some hot items that you guys definitely need to pay attention to. Now, I just want to say up front, because of the price variation of these items, you guys are not going to be buying a bunch of these off the market, uh, but the, this is just something uh, more that you can keep in mind so you can make some money while you're running around the world. Uh, this includes some items that you may or may not have been picking up or not been paying attention to that you should be paying attention to uh, so you can make some cash along the way. Now, the items in question are, of course, the infused health potions. As the release of Outpost Rush has happened, um, these have shot up quite a bit. Uh, these were up to 15, but the price has been dropping, but worry not. You can still make some money on these. Now, if you're getting them, if you're farming them from boxes because you guys are running in a dungeon or open world elite and you have a healer or you're running with the healer all the time and you really have nothing to do with these, um, then you can sell your access. Uh, currently on our server, they're selling for about eight to nine gold a pop. They were up to 15 yesterday, but the price has been dropping a little bit. So pay attention to these um, just because again, people are using these for outpost rush i've went through a hundred of these myself i go through about 30 a day ish now uh, i know you can craft them in outpost rush using the azot that you find in the outpost rush thing but people especially frontline i'm not trying to waste time doing pve uh, when i could be fighting <laughs> so uh, you guys can sell these these are really really hot now uh, if we take this a step deeper the recipe for the infused health potion includes earth motes all right, so if you guys are looking for earth motes or if you guys happen to find earth motes in the world, uh, these can also be sold and or gathered if you guys are doing the crafting yourself. Soul motes as well are also a good one that you guys can use and you guys can kind of do your thing here. But more importantly, of all of these materials, one thing that most people kind of overlook is the Azoth water. Azoth water right now is the hotness. All right, it's selling for four, four gold a pop. It's really, really easy to find. All right, so if you guys have been using the Map Genie IO that I've been talking to you guys about a lot, uh, there's quite a few spots. Reek Water is probably the best place in the world to get Azoth World that I've found. Uh, but if you can find it pretty much anywhere, um, it's, it's good to pick up. You're typically getting about four to eight per Azoth vial. You can find them all throughout here. There's a nice little spot that I like to use. The respawn time is about 10 minutes. And right along this wall, here this base all along this route here and all up here is good now the reason why I like this area down here is because it doesn't matter what level you are if you're AFK farming meaning you're doing something else like homework or schoolwork or whatever there's like uh, I think four nodes all the way across here uh, with no monsters or anything that you have to worry about and you could just grab these one two three four boom wait like ten minutes get them again one two three four boom if you guys are trying to do a route you can run all the way along the swamp run across here all the way back up and all the way back around you will have to deal with some 58 to 60s throughout here so be ready but they're kind of squishy there are some elite bears though that you have to run into here in reek water but other than that it's pretty solid uh there's some other spots in reek water over here that also have azoth water but you know i know you probably don't want to deal with a lot of mobs <laughs> So like I said, right here is a nice AFK spot. Uh, if you guys check mapgenie.io uh, with the New World thing, like they have a bunch of other locations where you guys can find Azoth water as well. Uh, but with our powers combined, Captain Planet <laughs> uh, comes out. But anyway, if you use the Earth modes, the Soul modes, plus the Azoth water, you can either sell the items individually, uh, depending on what server you're on and how the prices are coming up, because these are the materials that the potion crafters are using. Or you can just sell the Azoth water directly and just make your money up front. So that's something that you guys definitely want to get on right now. Again, these are not things that you're going to be buying out of the marketplace. This is just more things to be aware of so you can sell as much as you can before the price drops to the point where it's just not worth it anymore. <laughs> so if you guys are watching this video, today is your day to gather all these materials, chuck them in the marketplace, uh, do whatever you know strategy you're trying to employ to make as much money as you can while Outpost Rush is hot, and then, uh, you know, do your thing. So anyway, guys, that's all I wanted to cover today. If you guys got any questions, comments, concerns, definitely let me know in the comment box below, and I'd be happy to assist, and we will see you guys in the next video. Peace. T R I N I T Y V two fly. B boy L at the young son. I be damned like they know that they all run. Red wet to the face, not a